Hey there, brilliant folks. Welcome back to another eye-opening episode of Brilliance, your one-stop shop for all things health and wellness. You know, we all love the idea of drinking water straight from the tap. It's convenient, right? But what if I told you that the very water you trust could be secretly detrimental to your health? Yeah, it's a shocker. So grab your reusable water bottles, folks, because by the end of this video, you might never look at your tap water the same way again. First up, let's talk about water contamination. Ah yes, the tap water you think is pristine and clear can contain a cocktail of invisible, harmful substances. We're talking about bacteria, viruses, and even parasites. Your tap water may undergo treatments at water plants, but these treatments aren't foolproof, my friends. Let's move on to chemical additives. Chlorine is commonly used to disinfect water, but guess what? Chlorine itself can interact with organic matter in water to create toxic byproducts, and you don't need a chemistry degree to know that's not something you'd want inside your body, right? Now let's go heavy on the heavy metals. Lead, mercury, and arsenic can sneak their way into your water system through old pipes or natural contamination. You won't taste them, you won't see them, but they'll be there, building up in your system over time. Do you feel the chills yet? Here's another stunner. Pharmaceuticals and hormones can end up in your water supply too. How? When people take medications, their bodies don't absorb everything. The leftovers get flushed down, eventually making their way back to our water supply. This is like an unwanted sequel to a movie you never asked for. Oh, and let's not forget about fluoride. Yes, it's great for preventing tooth decay, but too much fluoride can lead to a range of health problems. So the question is, do the pros outweigh the cons? That's something to ponder on your next refill. Plastic microparticles are the new invaders, my friends. They can come from many sources like water bottles or even your tap's own filtration system. These minuscule plastic pieces could end up in your body and the long-term effects are still a mystery. Okay, so now that I've scared the living daylight out of you, what can you do? Well, it's not all doom and gloom. From water testing kits to water filtration systems, there are ways to ensure you're drinking the purest water possible. Some people even go for distilled water, which is basically water in its purest form. All right, it's time for the big reveal that I promised. What if I told you that some countries and states have recognized these issues and have taken drastic measures to improve their water quality, but the majority still lags behind? Shocking, right? And there's more. There's an ongoing debate about how water quality should be standardized worldwide, and by participating in this discussion, you can make a difference. So there you have it, brilliant folks. I hope this episode has enlightened you about the hidden dangers in your tap water. You might have started this video thinking tap water was just H2O, but I bet you're now realizing it's more like H2. Whoa, what's in this? Remember, we don't just bring you problems, we bring you solutions too. So take the first step in making a difference. Test your water, filter it, and most importantly, stay informed. Thanks for watching, and until next time, stay brilliant. There you have it. A comprehensive, emotional, and hopefully captivating script about why tap water could be harmful to your health. Now go ahead and enlighten the world with this essential information.